Hey guys, look, I want gonna do this video. I've been trying not to, but I need to get some things off my chest. And I'm actually working tonight as overtime, which I didn't want to do. I just felt obliged to because I like my boss. So I'm a bit fucking pissed off. And I've had a couple of cans of Guinness as well. And if you know my history by my channel, you know that sometimes I'll have a rant when I've had a few beers. Oh. Right, shall we get this over with? I'm going to talk crude, okay. Um, but that's... I can only fucking word things how I word them. Do you know what I mean? Right. I'm going to start with the man in the shed. Right, Paddy. Fuck me, you make me fucking fuming recently. How often do you say birds of a feather flock together? How often do you say that? Who is your best mate? A fucking convicted sex offender. Right? And what fucking pisses me off with you, you fucking crack pipe gargling cunt, is this is what's really pissed me off this part. You're defending Shadow, saying, but he ain't a rapist. Right. Guys, I pray it never happens. But I've put myself into this imaginary scenario. You have... Right, so Paddy says Shadow's not a grey pest. He's only done it once to um, an adult. So that's all right then, isn't it, Paddy? But if any one of us had a family member, right, and a bloke strangled her, forced his dick into her mouth, we would hate him the same as if he raped her. There is no difference. You... It's violation. A sexual assault is the same as rape. It's exactly the same mental damage to the victim. You fucking crack pipe, gargling, stupid, fucking cunt. Fuck me. How the fuck can you sit in your shed and defend Shadow? It's no different from rape. Why can't you see that? You fucking... Oh. Make, honestly, right, I'm sorry, guys, but this has been building up for a while. It really has. Sexual assault and rape does the same mental damage. You cannot defend any of them. They're both on the same level. And this is the guy who always say birds of a feather flock together. So why is your fucking mate a sex offender? Hmm. Think you've won the internet over. Got all these fans now. Got creepy sucking you off on that. Well, some of us, you aren't won over. We see right through you. You're a narcissistic bully defending sex offenders. Right, I'm going to have to go off that subject because I'm so fucking angry. But I haven't had a rant for a long time. Right, my next issue is, and I'm just going to use names because I don't give a fuck, is Paul Venus, or Venice, however you fucking pronounce it. Do you know what, I'm that mad. I've, um, I've lost it a little bit. Okay, Paul Venice. I'll be respectful because I don't mind you. I haven't minded you in the past, but you've pissed me off. I am autistic, right? Now, someone suggested to you that autism's from genetics. It is. Most of the time, it is. Okay? It is. 
It just fucking is. It runs right down the line in my family to me, okay? If your parents are autistic, you're more likely to be, a lot more likely, okay? Now, why would that offend you with suggestion that it's genetic? Because there's nothing wrong with it. My dad's autistic. It's not diagnosed because it didn't exist. He's in his 80s, but I know it is by my own diagnosis and how I act. There's nothing wrong with my dad. Nothing wrong with him. I, I probably got his genetics, okay? Not my dad's fault. He didn't do it on purpose. And there's nothing wrong with him as a person. So why did it offend you so much, the suggestion that it could be from genetics? Is that because you thought somebody was possibly saying it was from you? And if it was from your wife, so fucking what? Because there's nothing wrong with her neither. Do you know what I mean? You're a man who I've respected and looked up to because you're like an advocate for autism awareness. You do charity work. And then you go and fuck it by spitting your fucking dummy out because someone suggested it could be from genetics. I'm speechless and I feel let down. And that's my rant over because I'm too pissed off to carry on. Okay? Have a nice day, guys.